Well, that was awful. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the bonus episode for Wild Earth African Safari. Today, we're going to check out the Safari Arcade games that come along in the game. Uh, we unlock these by playing the main uh, Safari games. I mean, the main Safari levels. And I just wanted to show off these arcade games before I call it quits on uh, African Safari. So let's just go in order from left to right, up and down. Uh, for elephant wash. Now, then keep in mind this game in general is made for kids, so I assume these uh, arcade games are going to be relatively simple. Now, here's the problem I'm using an emulator and an Xbox 360 controller, so uh, <laughs> these are going to be interesting from a controller standpoint. <laughs> Guide an elephant in washing a mig migrating herd. Why would they do that? Get more points for bigger animals. Shower an animal enough and it will become shiny and clean. Point the Wii Remote to aim your trunk. Hold B to gush out water. Point the Wii Remote down to fill your water trunk. How do I? Uh... Oh. This is weird. <laughs> what is this? This is like the most germophobic elephant. That's my... I like to think of the cannon now. This is the most germophobic elephant in the world. And he's just offended by the fact that his neighbors don't wash. And a sandstorm just went in and he's gotta clean them. He's just got to. He can't handle the dirt. It's in him to clean it. He doesn't care why they're dirty. You know, he's just gotta clean them. This guy just spends all day in the local, local pond, just obsessively cleaning himself and his neighbors. And today of all days, uh, a sandstorm came in and just got everyone covered in the nastiest yellow dirt. He's just cannot handle this yellow dirt. It is just offending him. He has got to clean it no matter what. The, mo the more he sees, the more offended he gets. Am I cleaning anything? There we go, there we go. No, come back here. You're not yet clean. You are unclean. What the hell? Oh, calm down. What? Okay. Well, that was elephant watch. <laughs> All right, and her next game will be Meerkat Madness. Uh, is this gonna be Whack-A-Mole but Meerkats? If so, I'm not happy about this. Bonk those Meerkats when they peek. Hammer your way to the high school. I feel like this, this feels very separate from the other game. This feels like the guy in the corner made these <laughs> and, and, and doesn't give a shit about anim the animal educational part. And why do you sound like monkeys? Aim the Wii Remote to position the mallet over the Meerkat tunnels. Uh, when the Meerkat peeks out of the tunnel, swing the nunchuck like a hammer to bonk it on the head. That's not gonna work. This is gonna be awful. How do I...? Okay, wait, 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 wait. I don't know how to... I can't bonk. I don't think I can bonk. There's something I could do with the controller, but... I can do this. Why do you sound like monkeys? Is this doing anything? It might be? No. <laughs> well, 
No, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, I'll live knowing that I am not the high score holder for mirror cat madness. I, I will survive, unlike those mirror cats that were bonked by other people, not me. All right, next is Vulture Pilot. <laughs> Oh no, hold the Wii remote and the nunchuck upright, tilt both to turn, lean back to climb, lean forward to dive, to gain speed, flap the vulture swing with tilting. That's okay, this is gonna be awful. No! No! <gasps> no! Oh. Well, this is probably pretty effective, honestly. I could do this. This is fine. Oh! Did I figure it out? No. It's... It's not very good. I'm, not, I'm gonna be honest, it's not very good. I don't... I don't... <laughs> Are we going fast? How does this even work? I don't, I don't know. We are the slowest vulture. This is actually impressive how slowly we're moving forward. Look at that. How are you doing this vulture? The vulture's a freaking helicopter or something. <laughs> that was Im I think that was more impressive than if he flew, flew normally. I'm going to be honest with you. All right, time for Pond Rush. This is going to be, uh, fun, I guess. Save your favorite photos to your portfolio. No, I'm good. Pond Rush. Guide the frog- Shut up! Guide the frog to a nearby pond. Watch out for the other animals. Lift the Wii remote quickly to make the frog jump. Rotate the remote side to side to aim the frog's direction. What? <laughs> this is- this is actually doable, surprisingly. I'm definitely missing some key features, but I'm doing it! said I was doing it, right? It's- that's- that's why. Whoa! Actually, it's cool to see the animals this close. Obviously, it'd be better if we could see them that close, like, doing natural things, but, you know. Giant mushrooms because this is a video game. Actually, it's a really good thing this one works because uh, the timer goes up instead of down, so I don't think there's a way to just wait until the timer runs out. So it's a good thing this one actually works for me. What is everyone doing in this one little thing? Alright, I'm gonna say it. This frog sound is getting annoying. <laughs>
It's railroading me towards the shit. No, I'm, I refuse to jump in the shit. There you go, haha. -ha. And now I'm stuck. Are you serious? Help. How, are you serious? Because apparently invisible walls is one of the obstacles. And because I refused to jump into the wall of literal shit, I am now trapped in this hell. This froggy, annoying hell. Why are you doing this to me, froggy? I thought we had an understanding. Why did they make it like this? Why? This is gonna be the end of my video thing. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, 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 we did it. <laughs> we did it, bitches. And I'm greeted with just the worst sound. Make the frog shut up now, please. I'll take it. All right, let's go with Hungry Hyena. that noise? That's fucking Cthulhu speaking to me. A very hungry hyena is looking out for dinner. Help him find food. Find animal carcasses. Use the control stick to move. Press A button to begin eating. Watch your points go up. A carcass is no longer provide points when it turns into bones. Other predators will be eating too. Shake the Wii remote to scare away other scavengers and gain time. But watch out for lions. They'll attack you in drain time. Wow, did everything just die? <laughs> Everything's just dead now. Like, seriously, did poisonous gas end up in the air or something? I don't even have to scare the other ones. I could just go up to the thing. The zebras have whale bones, apparently. Oh. Like, seriously, are we fucking Kirby here? <laughs> Hooray! That was my food! Oh my god, look at this! <laughs> get down to just the lion what the lions eat
go. Why is that the game over screen? Why does it do this? Stop that. Stop it. It's upsetting. Alright. <laughs> that wasn't too bad. It wasn't particularly fun, though. Alright, Ostrich Dash. Okay. Guide the ostrich through the course. Go faster for a high score. Shake the Wii Re Oh no. Shake the Wii Remote and then nunchack uh, up and down. Alternatively, to uh, gain speed. Both quickly to jump over obstacles. Tilt both to turn. Oh no. Stop! What are you doing? Stop! What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> oh no. This is my life now. It's just a shittier version of the frog one. All right, next is Menagerie. Uh, a little worrisome on that title. Oh god, make it stop! Select the correct animals for a high score. They're running around like crazy. Read which animal to target. It will change frequently. Point the re rem Oh no. Point the re remote at the animal and select the A button to get points. Oh no. This is not gonna work. What am I looking for? A zebra. Z zebra. Did I get zebra? No. Wildebeest. What the fuck are we doing to them when we pick them up? Do we just throw them? Elephant. Uh. Gazelle. Uh. This is very difficult. Yeah, we're just absorbing them into us? What's happening here? I wonder why they're running around like crazy. We appear to be aliens in a spaceship. Oh my god, we totally are. <laughs> what the hell? This is so- this is very surreal. Yeah, seriously, we are aliens just kidnapping these animals. Oh no, not even- even the elephants are- are, are being kidnapped. Even they're not safe. This is what happens when cows get too boring for aliens. I must return to my people! Away! <laughs> God, this is this is so doofy. Oh my god. <laughs> that one's just stuck. Just slowly being absorbed. Did they just spawn in the elephants in the corner? Make it stop. Make it stop. <laughs> I don't want to be an alien abducting uh, animals that really need to be left alone anymore. At least with cows, it was cows and not, you know, you know, wild animals that need to be protected. Creature sequence. That sounds alarmingly... That sounds like something that would be the last game. Match the order of the actions. How many sequences can you memorize? Oh no, it's freaking Simon. Observe as the animals perform actions in a certain order. Remember it. Remember it. Each sequence is identical to the previous, plus one more step. Uh, point the Wii Remote at animals and press A button. Select them in order. 
Okay. This is going to be awful. It's like they're all having seizures. These animals need help. Like, they didn't even isolate the zebra sound. tired of this. I'm going to lose on purpose. Yeah, no, stop. Oh god, it's followed me out <laughs> to the loading screen. <laughs> Can't stop, won't stop. Flamingo dancer. I don't think that means what you think it means. Help a flamingo with his dance moves. Synchronize your gestures gestures with the others. Hold the remote up and watch the arrows. Is this a shitty dance dance revolution? Move left to spread the flamingo's left wing. Move spread right for right. Down head up. Oh my god, it's a new record of, of shit. Alright, and next is Hippo Kayak, which is not a good idea. <laughs> Isn't that how King Tut died? Navigate the river water inhabited by hippos. Hold your Wii remote with the buttons facing upward like a kayak paddle. Tilt the paddle back and forth to build up speed. This is not gonna work. Oh! Oh! Shit! This is working. Sort of. I can't... Just go full speed. Don't mind them. It's so crashed by now. Not to mention the crocodiles. This would be a horrible place to kayak. Wop, 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 wop. 
Uh, you just kind of whoop 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 Oh god This way, yeah Oh no Help Things say what? <laughs> Let me get this straight. You can't die, but you can beat yourself. This actually might be a better idea to do it this way. <laughs> this is a terrible, terrible idea. hippos we'll be totally dead by now who the fuck put camp right here they're fired <laughs> I was a little worried that wasn't the end I was gonna like oh shit we beached ourselves for no reason anyway all right and I think this is our last one prickly defense okay Prickly defense. Help a porcupine defend himself from curious carnivores. Scare them away with dangerous quills. Use the control stick to point the porcupine pills at it. Quills, not pills. Quills. <laughs> Dr. Sonic is in the house. Uh, shake the Wii, Wii remote to scare them back. If a carnivore touches you, you lose a chance. You only have three chances. How long can you fend them off? Go for the top score. What? How, how, shake the Wii remote to scare them back. Uh, this is gonna be awful. This is... How do I... No, I gotta just... <laughs> this is not working. <laughs> I am the worst porcupine, send help. And that children is survival of the fittest. I do not make a good porcupine. Good to know. <laughs> Uh. All right, and we're gonna call it there for today. That is the official last video of Wild Earth African Safari. Everybody say goodbye. Goodbye. Um, this was a very interesting game, and the arcade games, you know, I, I get why they added them. This is a game for children at, at the end of the day. Um, so th th they're not, they don't harm anything. It's not like they take away from anything. They're just kind of there. I think I would try them. If I had this game on the Wii back in the day, I would try them once and never touch them again. Uh, <laughs> and I, that's the case here too. And I, even if I, like, I think even if I could play all the games, I just wouldn't be interested, not even as a kid. Uh, <laughs> what I'm here for is the safari and the, you know, in the photos and all that stuff, so uh, I, I know I wouldn't be particularly interested in arcade games, but I did enjoy this game overall and uh, I hope you guys join me for the next Safari Sundays. Uh, thank you guys so much for coming by. Please join me next time. I love you and bye bye